What's up guys, Chad Caruso here, and today I'm gonna to teach you how to axle stall on a mini ramp. Now before you start learning this trick, you should be able to drop in and backside kick turn. All right, so axle stalls can be pretty difficult when you're first learning them. Just trying to get the feel of standing up on top of the coping. And this trick might feel a little shaky at first, but it's definitely gonna be one of your main setup tricks when skating a mini ramp. So you definitely wanna take the time and get good at it. So as you're approaching the coping coming perfectly straight, you're gonna wanna press on the tail just slightly and start your kick turn. And as you kick turn, you're gonna let this wheel come onto the coping and then press on your heels. That's the trick. Right, because everyone wants to stay flat footed or on their toes. But you gotta think of it as you're almost leaving the mini ramp and you're just gonna stand straight up on the coping. Right? So if you wanna bail this out, you could even hop up right up onto the top and feel it out. But yeah, I would say the real trick is to just make sure you're standing up on the coping. Alright? So one more time, you're just gonna come up almost straight. Once your wheel starts to hit, that's when you're barely even gonna turn. You're just gonna stand up and the rest should take care of itself. So one of the biggest mistakes people make when they're doing axle stalls is they get their entire truck on the coping. Now this may feel safer at first, but when you go to come back in, your truck has the potential of hanging up like this and then you're getting pitched to the flat. I don't think anybody wants to do that. Yeah, just make sure you lock in on this wheel. All right, so after you start feeling comfortable standing up on the coping, now it's time to just finish the kick turn and come back in. And after you get that trick down, you try to learn some variations. If you guys have any questions about how to do any of these tricks, feel free to leave them in the comments below. Also, if you want to leave a request for a trick, I'm always looking for ideas. Alright, thanks for watching.